everyone welcome back to my channel this is raja from iit madras i am an ms colony department of electrical engineering at iit madras so in this video i am going to talk about something very important which is iits for doctors yeah you heard it right usually iits are catering the needs of the our engineering student but in the recent time many iits including iit madras is trying to include doctors uh, as well in their ecosystem so in this initiative recently iit madras has introduced a special program designed for the doctors uh, if you are not aware uh, aware please watch the video till the end and if you have any friend who is a doctor or mbbs aspirant or bds aspirant then you can share this video or information with them so that they can utilize this opportunity and then they can build their career so without wasting your time let us move on to the screen and let's see what are the pros cons what are the features opportunity of this program and let's go so welcome back so right now i am in the official website of department of medical sciences and technology of iit madras so its website is mst.iitm.ac.in and bs in medical science and engineering so you can go through this website if you are interested in this and uh, as far as i know this department of medical science and technology has been incorporated incorporated in the iit madras last year only so and uh, uh, under which several programs are initiated so one of them uh, one of the program is the four year bs program in medical science and engineering there are other program also which will be introduced uh, one by one so if you see the programs uh, yeah here you can see academic so this is the bs in medical science and engineering the phd program for doctors this is specially designed for the doctors or mbbs aspirant and maybe the bds uh, doctors can also apply for that but it right now it is not clarified and this is the ms by research for doctors and then again this is the ms in medical science and engineering and this is for the engineers and this phd program for science and engineering students so they have segregated the ms and phd for the doctors and engineers so if you are really interested then you can opt for this ms or phd designed especially for the doctors and this is the bs program this is the undergraduate program of this department bs in medical so if you see the about the department introduction to department so the primary objective is to the development state engineering physiologist and physician scientist so they want the, the uh, want to train the individual in such way that they can cater the needs of the engineering field as well as the medical field so that they be, so that they can better understand the problem and solve the uh, various issues related to the biomedical engineering and so they will define the future of the medicine so with the with the right platform and resources a physician scientist and engineering physiologist will be able to create ground breaking technology so this is our the objective it does not much concern to our thing so if you see the academic model yeah so to cater the needs of the doctors so they have tied up with the several hospitals so that they can provide you a better experience so if you see a lot of the uh, hospitals in the nearby has been uh, uh, partnered so sankanetal is uh, related to the eye specialist eye care and it is a very well known eye care hospital mmm hospital mgm healthcare uh, vhs hospital so if you see the structure of the department so two center of excellence in the physiology and translation the research in the medical image so two centers of excellence has been created and this is all about yeah so if you see the area of research so yeah this is the department of medical science and there are basically two sub departments center of excellence for physiology and translation research and for medical image so if you see and then the sub area includes uh, cardiovascular medicine orthopedics parentology and pediatrics 
ophthalmology, oncology, neurology, neurosurgery, nephrology, and urology. So these are the various subject parts or area of research you can see. Another thing which I want to point out. Yeah, if you see the, the research area, cardiology and the cardiovascular surgery, these are the area of research, and you can see the sub area in this surgical planning and minimally, minimally invasive surgery, digital twins, and therapeutic planning. So these are the actually areas in which the uh, which require the expertise of the doctor as well as engineers, and so you can go through this area. And if these areas are matching with your interest, then you can apply. These are the areas. Right now, it is not clear whether they will allow the MBBS doctors or the BDS doctors or both. So, uh, if you see uh, PhD program for the doctors, it is uh, written that uh, is it uh, planning to offer MS and PhD program for January 2024. So, uh, right now it is not started. So, they will uh, start offering from end 2024 so if you are interested you can subscribe for updates so that you will not miss so if you are really interested i would suggest you please fill the form so that you will get the uh, updates regularly from the department so right now they have not clarified whether it is applicable to the uh, which type of doctors that md is required or mbbs is fine or various doctors are allowed or not so it will be cl uh, clarified once the, all the uh, details will be released. So if you see BS in medical science, this is a four year program. So let me go through uh, curriculum. So BS is clear, uh, BS program is already started and uh, it is clearly clarified. So if it is a semester wise credit. So if you see the syllabus uh, from the first semester onwards, they started towards the uh, medical sciences, mechanics for the medical scientists, mathematical foundation for the medical scientists, introduction to an uh, anatomy. So the faculty who are offering this, uh, uh, who are uh, offering the courses in the department are from the allied areas of the engineering design, applied mechanics, uh, electrical engineering, like that. So you can go through the syllabus. So one important thing is the eligibility criteria for the BS in medical science. So if you are not aware, let me tell you. Because right now the seats are very limited in the BS in medical science. Yeah, so see. Uh, right now it is closed, but uh, uh, the three criteria is not mentioned anywhere. Right now, they have closed the application. That's why the eligibility criteria is not mentioned anywhere. But uh, the uh, if you want to enter in this program, you have to give uh, the ICER aptitude test IAT. So through that, you can get admission in this uh, BS program. The seats are limited and very competitive too. So if you see the structure, the anatomy and the physiology of the organ, mathematical modeling. And if you see the electives and the destination, they are basically AI and ML in medicine. In this area, maybe a lot of students are very interested. And medical imaging is also very interesting field. Device development and the pharmacology are also uh, interesting, but it is more uh, oriented towards the designing part. And there are a lot of doctors 
also who are teaching in this program. So let me go through you. Uh, MS by research for doctors. Right now they have not updated much information on the website, but you can mail them if you want uh, any answer. So the head of department is the Professor Bobby George. So you can directly mail to the MST head and the idm.ac.it or you can subscribe. So you will get answer. Otherwise you can also ask me. I will try my best. So this is all about uh, this uh, department. So if you are interested, you can go through it. So if you see there, the biomedical engineering division had started in 1959. So this is all about this department. Apart from this, uh, if you are a doctor or MBBS aspirant and you want to get into IIT, you can also uh, opt for the gate paper in the biomedical engineering or the biotechnology. And through that, you can uh, come to the IIT uh, uh, and get admission in the MS or PhD. So a lot of institutes, including IIT Bombay, IIT Kharagpur, IIT Kanpur, IIT Jodhpur, and IIT Madras allows MBBS and BDS students in their program, provided they have the good gate to score or uh, the corresponding score in the NEET PG, NEET MDS. So, and uh, even the IIT Jodhpur has a special program for the doctors in the link with the uh, AIMS Jodhpur. So uh, there's a uh, IITs are, uh, are now trying to include the doctors as well in the, their ecosystem and uh, you can utilize these opportunities. So this is all about this video. Thank you for watching this video. If you have any doubt, please let me in the comment section. I will try my best to answer. Thank you.